Alright guys, thanks for stopping in and taking a look at the video. Um, today we're going to be working on a tutorial. Um, I've never done these before, so bear with me. Um, but today we're going to be working on how to get the current version of Reshade 5.4.2 to work in 5M. Um, I learned this uh, little trick from uh, another SLRP member, um, Sean B. So I'd like to thank him for... Uh, filling me in on how to do this um, without wasting any time let's go ahead and get into it um, any link that I use in this video will be in the description along with um, a few other things um, as you can see here I'm on 5M um, I do not have reshade installed um, so I'll go ahead I'm going to exit 5M and as you can see, I'm here on the Reshade website. Um, if you don't know how to get to that, you can Google Reshade or, like I said, the link is in the description. Just go to reshade.me um, and it will bring you to this page here. So what you want to do once you get there is scroll down to the bottom and you will see the link for download Reshade 5.4.2. So go ahead and click on that. Once that finishes downloading down there at the bottom, we'll go ahead and click the arrow and click open. And it will bring you to this. Once you open this, you're going to be looking for the GTA 5 EXE. Um, I have no clue why mine says to do. Um, could tell you. But anyway, we're going to be clicking on that and then we'll click on next. Um, we want to install the DirectX 10, 11, 12 version, so make sure that that one is ticked. Click next. Once you come to this page, you're just gonna hit and skip that and click next. Um, it will then bring you to a page that looks like this. So you can either click on all of these one by one, or you can click uncheck all, and then check all. This will automatically check all of them. After that, you'll click next. It will do its little thing here to install it. Then you'll click finish. That's step one. So after that, we can go into 5M. And once we open up 5M, you'll notice that reshade once again did not pop up that's fine so we'll go ahead and we're gonna click F8 so now you'll notice that it says script reshade blocked load of reshade version 5 or higher it has a bug that will lead to game crashes in GPU drivers or d3d11.dll if you want to force it to load anyway, add the following section to uh, this pathway, which uh, yours, I believe, is probably going to be about the same, but this is my pathway. Um, so what we're going to be paying attention to here on this screen is this whole section here, from the bracket add-ons bracket all the way to the end of the word game crashes. So... What we're going to do is, I know you can't copy this, but it will be in the description uh, for you to copy and paste in yourself. Um, the real thing you want to pay attention to is the ID. So mine is D10B07CD. That is not going to be yours. Yours is going to be something totally different, but that's what you want. So you want to write that down, uh, put it in a notepad, spray paint it on the wall. I don't care. Just remember it. All right. So now we can close out of 5M. And now what we want to do is go down here to your Windows search. And you're going to type in percent app data percent and hit enter. This should bring you to here inside your roaming folder once you're there you want to hit up on the arrow and click into local once you're in local you'll scroll down until you find 5m open that up 
and then once you're in here you will go to 5m application data once in here you're going to be looking for the citizen fx configuration file it's going to be this one right here don't try to do it to any of the other ones so click in there and you'll notice that it looks something like this so this is where what uh, you're supposed to post that was in 5m so go ahead and copy that from the description of the video and like I said remember your ID number so you will come into this page hit enter from the build number and then I will paste on that whole line that we had just seen in 5m and as you can see it has the number that 5m gave me in there so that's what you will want to change on the one that you pulled from the video description once you're done with that you can click file save close that out then we can go back and open 5m And as you can see, Reshade 5.4.2 is working. You can hit Home, which you can change this. You can hit Home, Continue, Finish, and I like to do this, hit Reload. And these are all of the ones that I use myself. Uh, feel free to go through and see what you can get going. Um, I hope you guys liked the video. Um, leave a like, uh, comment, maybe subscribe. Um, until next time.